There can be no law tube drama if there is no law tube. Law tube is fucking gay. It is so shit. It is dumb. It's a bad idea. It is a bad implementation. And I talked about this. None of this matters. This is all stupid because we're not an organization and never should be. Ever. For fuck's sake, stop begging to be a thing. I don't care how shitty and little your YouTube channel is and how much you really want to grift off of someone else in network at will as if there's some expectation that you'll be invited to the party. There is no party. Unless you want it. I mean, if, if you guys want it, not you, the chat. I'm talking to the other content creators out there. If you guys want your little weird commie circle jerk, have the fuck at it. But I tried to tell you, stop doing this. You are independent. And if you're independent and failing, then fucking fail. And then get better and try something else or try again. Don't be independent failures and then go, oh, well, if only I had a network of people to mooch off of, then we'll be successful. Wait a minute. The we there was weird because you were failing and the other person wasn't. So if you're failing and the other person isn't failing, we don't become successful together. You are taking from them something and trying to bolster yourself. But you're not learning how to fucking do it. This is the problem. You're not getting any better at it. You're just relying on the concept of LawTube to increase your own or to cover up your own inadequacy. Stop it. Some of you need to fail. Some of you are really, really bad at this. And I'm not saying fail forever, but you need to fuck up and realize that you have fucked up and that your show format is bad. Your jokes aren't good. Your personality isn't good for this. Whatever it is, I don't know. I don't have a comprehensive list of who is what. But some people can hold an audience and others can't. And them's just the fucking ropes of entertainment. And if you can't handle that, fucking leave. Or get better. But stop like demanding other people to be responsible for your failures. It's the biggest problem with this fucking group. And guys, I have had so many conversations behind the scenes. And I won't ever say with who. But uh, absolutely just raw fucking entitlement. Just. Well, we need to do this. You need to help out here. Have this person on. Have me on. Come on my show. Not like, there are people who ask, of course. A lot of my friends, you know, hey, would you like to come on this day? Hey, uh, you, you doing anything where you could use another voice? Sure, fine, cool. But some people, it's like, well, we have to do this. We have to do that. No, no, fuck off. Stop it. Because people are trying to make a network and they're trying to do it. Well, I should be getting these subs. I should be getting these views. I should X. I should Y. I should Z. And a lot of these people popped up. I mean, their channels popped up out of nowhere really quickly, uh, grew. And they're like, well, I deserve this. No. <laughs> you, you caught a good, you caught a good wave and you wrote it. You didn't deserve anything. Nobody deserves any of this. Nobody deserves success on social media. Nobody deserves it. You work your fucking ass off and you find those waves and you ride them, you ride them to shore, man. And then you paddle out and you do it again. 
But you notice some people, man, they go that like they're that wave, they are on top of the world. And then once that wave crashes, they are in the fucking dumpster. And they expect, like, well, I've been doing this for months. <laughs> months? Jesus Christ. We're all fucking charmed. We're all charmed. Like, I've been doing this for five years, and I am charmed in my growth. There's a bunch of people out there who've been doing these, uh, who've been doing YouTube or, or whatever for 10 years plus, and their channels are stuck, and they can't get the algorithm, and they can't get the audience. And these aren't bad YouTubers. These are not bad content creators. But some of the people in LawTube absolutely are. So I'm calling it out. And this is why I'm not in it, never wanted to be in it, will never be in it. Because the level of entitlement and circle jerkery that can go on in those types of groups makes me want to die. And anyone who thinks they're entitled to subscribers or entitled to views needs to get off the fucking internet right now. Nobody owes you shit. You are trying to get into one of the most charmed lives possible. <laughs> Guys, my life <laughs> is so fucking funny and ridiculous. Like the way it works out. Um, it's charmed. I am thankful for every second of it, even the shitty seconds of it. I never thought the audience or anybody else owed me a fucking view. And there are people out there who really do think that. And it's kind of embarrassing. And in, I hate to say I told you so, but I fucking told you so. <laughs> and the second... The second that my YouTube is unsuspended, first, there's going to be an I'm back bitches video. That's going up. I'm going to grift, of course, my suspension on YouTube, my resurrection. That all, that all has to happen. I think that's Friday that that happens. Um, but probably the next video is going to be remember when I said this, and I'm going to clip out that segment about LawTube and the drama, and the bullshit, and the entitlement. Because I am Nostradamus, and I called all of this stuff. I called it all. And people are just, nobody wanted to listen to it. So I'm just going to clip that segment, and I'm going to post it up again. Because I guess everybody needs to be fucking reminded. And I, I don't know how anybody doesn't get this. So, and before, before anybody uh, wants to come out and be like, he's talking about this person or that person. No, I'm speaking very generally. And I'm saying that I hold an opinion that I will not share about some content creators being shit. But I don't shit on people specifically unless they shit on me. And I don't think anybody has lately. I mean, if they want if they want to do the man dance, we can do that, I guess, but I'm not really looking for that. So I'm telling people they need to be self and self-analyzing, self-aware of just how entitled they sound, of just how ridiculous the uh, the idea of some sort of blood debt that the chat owes to us is. That's retarded. And the sort of debt that other creators owe to anybody. Nobody owes anybody anything. We're all individual and we always should be. And if you want, like, if you want to sacrifice that into a gay little group, enjoy what comes with it, motherfucker. But never, ever, ever ask me to be a part of it. Miss me with that shit. 